Hey GVN, I'm Lucy Herrig, a senior here at Glenbrook North. Our school is sponsoring a 5K walk run on Saturday, November 14th. Check-in will be from 8 to 9 in the morning near the football stadium, but you can pre-register online this week. Our goal is to raise $10,000 to build a classroom which will put 100 students in school. If you sign up with four friends, you can know that you sent a child to school that may otherwise have never had a chance. Check out the display in the Student Activity Center. As more people sign up, you will see the number of pictures grow, the children we are helping. GBN is working with Rise International, a nonprofit organization whose mission is to partner to build primary schools in rural Angola in villages where there are none. The 27 year civil war left a generation without education unable to read and write. Since 2003, RISE has built 123 rural schools and about 55,000 children are in school that weren't just six years ago. I was a part of a RISE team in July and saw the impact that education is making. Hey GBN, I'm here at School of Laundry and this is the school that's just recently been built. This is the new design from RISE and I know this is something we can build together. Glenbrook North can make a difference. Hello, my name is Antonio. Antonio, a 14-year-old boy and the oldest in his family, is living in the village of Kabimbi. Antonio's uh, family lives a long way uh, from Kabimbi, and so he's come here to live with his uncle. Um, and he stays with him while his parents are there just so he can attend school. Antonio loves to draw and Portuguese is his favorite subject. He wants to be a teacher when he grows up. Antonio lives in this little hut with his uncle, his aunt, and his cousin. He sleeps on the floor here. He goes to school in the mornings and works in the fields in the afternoons. There has never been a school in Kavindi. The school meets the needs for more children while allowing for future expansion. They are buildings that will help educate not only these students, but generations to come. These children are the leaders of tomorrow. Students are actively engaged, and the community is grateful that their children will have what they only dream of. The students are singing a song about how beautiful their school is. And they're celebrating the fact that though they're about to leave school, they're celebrating the fact that they'll be together. Let's go!